This is Rhonda. Rhonda Anthony. Rhonda Anthony Tanner. Rare coaching. I exterminate the pest from your life. Hey, all my witchy wizards and magical magicians and muggles and stuff. Oh, today's going to be so cool because, like, I'm doing my whole show on Harry Potter cause, because, like, Harry Potter has, like, touched me right here, like, in my heart. It's just, like, touched me because he's, like, my hero and stuff. dun dun, dun Harry Potter Day. Yeah. And I thought, you know what, like, if we're doing, like, a whole show on ma magicians and, like, magic and stuff, why not bring, like, a real magician? Yeah. So, like, I invited this really cool magician named Rob Rasner to come into here and do some <sighs> magic for you guys. So, like, let's get to the Rob, Rob, Robbie magic right now. Magic time. <sighs> Okay, Rhonda, in honor of the Harry Potter theme, I think we should do a little magic. Okay, here, check this out. I've got something for you today. This will be fun. Here we go. You want to see the quickest trick I know? Yeah, this is I the, do. This is the quickest trick I know. Watch the blue hanky. Magic wand. What? Oh, my gosh. I want to touch it. You can touch it. She, she wants to touch my magic wand. That was so cool. Yeah, okay, never mind. Here, actually, um, in honor of the Harry Potter theme, I'm going to make you a present. Do you like presents? Oh, I love presents. Okay. I'm going to... Wait a second. Okay, here, let's just, I just got to fold this here. You just ripped my hat. It's okay, no. What are you going to, oh man, oh, here we go. You ready? Yeah, I'm Okay, ready. here's what I want you to do. Uh, blow on the, on the back of my hand. Okay, that was spit. Let's uh, try it, that's one okay. more time. <clears throat> I swallowed. It's okay. Nice. Okay, here. Oh, good, let's see. What is this? Is this a necktie? No. No. Not. Let's see. Well, check it out. It's your very own Harry Potter hat. Oh, Harry Potter hat. There you go. Hat. You enjoy that. Oh, my god. Wear gosh. it with pride. Oh, thank you, Rob. You're welcome. Okay. <laughs> well, <clears throat> part of the law of being a magician, part of the rules is that every magician that's in the handbook, you have to do a card trick. Do you like card tricks? Oh, I love card tricks. Okay, I'm going to show you a card trick, but um, there's a little secret behind when a magician does a card trick. Okay. Got these here. Come on, cards. Here we go, a little card trick. Card it's trick? a little secret. Now, when a magician does a card trick, he's going to tell you to watch the cards. Okay. Okay, now the secret is actually not to watch the cards. Okay. Believe it or not, the secret is to watch the box. See, the cards will come out of the box, but they actually they don't fit back in. Check it out. Oh. <gasps> yeah, it's, it's weird. Okay. Oh, that was cool. Here's what we're going to do. I use a regular deck of 52 cards. I do not use uh, magic or trick cards because that's cheating, and I don't want you to think that I cheat. Cheaters are bad. No, I do cheat. I just, you know, I don't want you to think oh, that. Oh, okay. Here, I'll tell you what. Go ahead and I'll take one out. Stand up, pick a card trick. Oh, you got one. Okay, show everybody. Show the viewers at home and the camera. I shall turn my back. Right. You ready? Okay, here. Uh, I'm going to take it back from you. We're going to use our magical powers together. I'm going to go like that and put it back in. Hold your hands out flat and steady like a table. And together, okay. flat, fingers together, flat, okay. flat, flat, steady. Watch. <laughs> <laughs> Just like that. Take that out. Show everybody. I'm so close. <laughs> there you go. It was the, the oh, uh, seven of clubs. Okay, I have one last thing I'd like okay. to share with you, um, but before we go any further, um, I need to know, do you have any money I could borrow? The bigger oh. the bill, the more fun the trick. I have, I have $10. $10, is that your life yeah. savings? No, it was no. for dinner tonight, okay. Subway. Subway, right yeah. on. Oh, Jared, eat fresh. Okay, go ahead and uh, sign your name on the bill. You can use the table. Okay. Okay, now what she's doing is called a felony. That's why I'm having her do it, not me. Perfect. 
Okay, if you notice, I have my sleeves rolled up, and the reason I do that is when people find out I do magic, they say, Steve, which yeah, is... Yeah, what are you hiding? Which is weird, because my name is Rob. Um, <laughs> they, ask me, they actually ask me to roll up my sleeves, and I don't know why, but I think it's because they want to know if I work out. Oh. But I don't. Okay, here we go. Here we go. We're going to fold up your ten just like this okay. and make it into a little gift or a present. Hold on to it like that. Okay. I've got some very expensive wrapping paper here. Oh, here it is. Ooh, I like wrapping paper. It reminds me of Christmas. <laughs> this is what I call a McDonald's toilet seat cover. I took it from the bathroom. Oh, I work at McDonald's. Oh, do you? Yeah, I Nice. Do. Which one? Um, the one in Sherman Oaks. Oh, <laughs> cool. Yeah. Okay, we're going to take your $10 bill, place it very carefully inside the Magic Pretend toilet seat cover. Fold it up just like... Okay, now, <clears throat> one more thing. I didn't bring any tape for your gift. I forgot. So we're going to use a little bit of uh, heat to melt the bottom and fuse the edges. Okay. Now, kids playing with fire is dangerous, so don't try this at home. Try it at your friend's house. <sighs> Here we go. We're just going to melt the bottom and just like, just hold it in there. That was my $10 bill. Start the car. What am I going to do for dinner? <sighs> I don't know, but I do. Uh, I'll tell you what. Um, I was really jonesing for like a big sub. Like a matzo ball kind of wine. Rhonda, I have, I have good news for you. I saved the money on my car insurance by switching to Geico. <laughs> Just kidding, I'm going to pay you back. Check it out. Okay. In my wallet is a zipper compartment. Inside the zipper compartment is an envelope, which I've sealed with a notary sticker before I came. Yeah. Inside this sealed envelope, I have some money. Hold out your hand like this. See if this is indeed the same 10. Unfold it and show everyone, show the camera, if it has your name <sighs> on it. If it is, order shall be restored to the world. I can get dinner tonight. <laughs> you can get dinner tonight. Yay. Oh, my gosh. Well, that's yeah. it for today. Thank you, Rhonda. Rob, he's, like, the best and stuff. Like, he does parties and, like, birthdays and everything. So, like, if you want to hire him, I just, like, love Rob. I do because he's Rob the magician. Say hi, Rob. Say hi to them. Hi, Rob. Hi to them. I'm, I'm amazing. What can I say? Spectacular. <laughs> Uh, we're going to do this like once a month, I promise. Wasn't that just like freaking awesome? I was like, love Rob and like magic and stuff. Hey guys, I hope you liked like my British accent and that you just loved Rob as much as I love Robbie Rob. Yeah. And in honor of, like, the book coming out, I thought, like, maybe I should write, like, a song and stuff. So I wrote a Harry Potter song. <sighs> ah, love Harry Potter. Ah, love Ron. <sighs> I love Dumbledore. I don't like Voldemort cause he's mean. This is the Potter song. I love my Potter song. R.A.T. loves H.P. Potter, Potter, Potter song. I love Hermione. I love Hagrid. I love Hogwarts. I don't like Snape cause he's a liar. This is the Potter song. I love my Potter song. R.A.T. loves H.P. Potter, Potter, Potter song. I love Buckbeak. I love Mr. and Mrs. Weasley. I love House of Dobby. I don't like Dudley, cause he's a bully. This is the Potter song. I love my Potter song. R.A.T. loves H.P. Potter, Potter, Potter song. This is the end of the Potter song. My Harry Potter song. R.A.T. loves H.P. Potter, 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 end of song. Have a magical magic rest of your day.